Okay, is this or is this not the weirdest teapot you've ever seen? Like, I know it's supposed to be an elephant, but I don't know. It looks a little inappropriate to me. <laughs> Hey friends, it's Alex with BF Vintage. I am over by a Goodwill near my house here in Phoenix, Arizona, and I'm gonna go see if I can find some treasures for my Etsy shop, my whatnot live sales, and my YouTube live sales. So yeah, let's see if we can find some treasures. But before we do, make sure you're hitting that subscribe button. It really helps me. It's a simple way that you can support me and my business. And yeah, let's do it, friends. Too bad. Four forty nine for him. These are so cute. Kitchtastic. Oh wow, they're like double sided. That is super sweet. Super sweet. Look, there's another one down here. These are really cute. She's also interesting. I like the texture of her hair. She doesn't have a price though, so I don't know. Oh, look at that bunny boy back there. He is adorable. I am definitely feeling that. What do you guys think? Let's see. Oh, look at all the little bunnies. I love them all. I think I have to get them all. Yep, that's happening. We will get them all. Okay, so here goes the first one. I was so excited, guys, because these were kitschtastic. But then I looked at this one and was like, excuse me, $9.50? So I put it in the cart and I thought, wait, another one, $9.50? Okay, I'm going to have to talk to them and be like, what's going on here? Can I have each one for $3.50 or are they all $9.50? So I ended up bringing them with me to see what will happen. So, cross your fingers. <laughs> this guy's only 99 cents, but I don't know, I'm not quite feeling it. Oh, look at her, she's got a little bird in her hand. Little blue bird, that is really cute. She's only 350. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna grab her too. She is really, really cute. Let's see, we got a little trinket. This one says made in China though, so they, they tricked me. They tricked me. This, for some reason, looks like uranium to me, but let's get our little flashlight and see. Oh, yep, that's uranium. You see that glow glow? Woo, we found a little baby uranium bowl. And it's only 99 cents, that's awesome. All right, let's go ahead and put that in the cart for sure. I will say I'm excited that the uh, the shelves seem to be full today, so they must have just restocked, which is fantastic, because I've been here to this one a few times, and um, like they just didn't really have as much on the shelves, so I'm really happy to see that. Ooh, we've got this beautiful religious piece back here with the Virgin Mary and Jesus, and that's really, really beautiful. I wish there was markings. I'm gonna see if I can check on that. So I did not see any markings on this one. So I think I'm gonna pass just because I'm not sure. Without markings, it is like, eh, a little bit too iffy. It's another pretty religious piece, but it does look more modern. So I'm gonna pass on that. Oh my goodness, these are chalkware prayer hands. That is very cool, only 252. Definitely seems like it's a lot newer and hardly any damage but I still am gonna get them because people really like them so we're grabbing that we are actually doing pretty we're off to a good start let's hope it stays that way I think we this one's really cool but I'm guessing it's a reproduction most of these are 
Oh, wow, wait. Maybe this one isn't. Definitely got some age to it. I can't tell, guys. I can't tell if it's a reproduction or not. I wish there was like more information. It sure is rusted. I think for 450, should I take a risk? I don't like that it has this scratch right here. But it is cool, so I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. We're gonna take a chance. Let's see if we let's see if the glass gods will be on our side today. This looks like depression glass. Just wish it had the stopper. If it had the stopper, that would be pretty cool. Especially in that like pink rose color. Definitely needs some cleaning too. I just wish it had the stopper, but it doesn't. So we leave it behind. Oh, look, it's a sheep. It reminds me of my bestie Tyler. He has whatnot sales and he has something he does whenever anytime someone wins. And it's the sheep of yes, and it's hilarious. So this makes me think of him. But it's definitely modern, so we're gonna pass on that. Oh, this is pretty. I believe this is um, made in um, Russia. Just trying to see if it's in good enough condition. There is some, oh yeah, there's some paint loss there. Can you see it? Which is such a bummer, because 99 cents is a great, great deal. And I love, love, love how vibrant the gold is in these pieces. It's like wood, lacquered wood, wood. But yeah, I can't do it with that damage. So we will keep on keeping on. Ooh, this is kind of like cottage core funky. Let's see. Really cute, but there is some damage there. And it does, you know, look modern to me. So I'm going to pass on that. That is so stinking cute. Look at that. Somebody made that. Adorable. A little bit of dirt on the back, but dude, anybody who's like a Cabbage Patch collector would love this. So I'm gonna grab it for 250 because I love the colors too. The retro like yellow and green. Yep, that's happening. Ooh, this box is really cool. Aww. Too bad it's starting to come apart. Too stinking bad. Oh, look, it's a little penguin. A little wooden penguin. Oh, he's got his little booties broken. No, your booties broken and your nose is repaired. You've been through some things, poor guy. It's okay. We've all been through some things. Oh, that's pretty. It looks like some like these black glass, but it is Avon. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know enough about these to know if anyone would be interested in this kind of thing. It is really pretty. But 350. I don't know if I want to take a risk. I'm going to pass. Okay. Is this or is this not the weirdest teapot you've ever seen? Like, I know it's supposed to be an elephant, but I don't know. It looks a little inappropriate to me. these really cool napkin holders they have a made in the Philippines sticker inside of them and they're giving me like tiki vibes although I can't quite tell if they're vintage or modern and there is a couple of little dings on there 350 how many are there let's see I think there's six Mm, I think I'm gonna get him. I think I'm gonna get him. Yeah, let's do it. Cute napkin holders, tiki napkin holders. All right, here's our cart shot. Hopefully I will be grabbing all these bunnies, but we shall see what happens. I'll let you know once we do the outro. 
Okay, friends, so we ended up spending $17.92. And bad news bear, they only let me have the one green bunny for $3.50. They would not let me take the others for $3.50. They were all priced at $9.50. So at least I got one. And uh, yeah, I really, really loved that Cabbage Patch art um the like um yarn art and it's got some ideas swirling in my head about some crafting I might want to do so anyways thanks for hanging out if you like what you saw please give us a like and if you want to see more videos make sure you hit that subscribe button till next time friends bye